Okay guys, we got my monster 120 gallon aquarium and now it's time to get it inside. my people and welcome to my house so today we are setting up the 120 gallon tank so today we went to PetSmart and the tank the filter was like a hundred dollars and I was like I don't want to pay a hundred dollars so they did price match I got it for thirty four dollars and life is good at the moment so we're gonna start setting it up me and Chrissy and let's get it going Okay guys, so right now we are emptying out this tank and we're going to put this water into the 120 and then Gretchen's going to go in there. Um, we're going to put dechlorinator in the water so everything's going to be fine. Right now Gretchen's freaking out um, because we're cleaning her, somewhat cleaning, somewhat emptying water out. But yeah, we're just, we're making it happen. So we're putting the water into these buckets right here before we move this tank into my room. So Gretchen's going to get a little stressed out right now so we probably cut the lights off so she thinks she's... She's just, she's just vibing now, but we're going to keep draining the water out, and then we'll bring y'all back when the tank is in the room empty, and then we'll start putting the substrate in. Okay, so we have currently moved this from here to there, got some water out of it. Gretchen's fine, so we're about to vacuum this up really quick, and then we're going to um, get the stand in place and the tank in place, so stay tuned. Okay, guys, so we just died getting a stupid <laughs> tank part into my room. <laughs> So we lifted it over this area. Now it's time to get it to my room. What's up guys? I'm in my bed because I'm tired. Because, as y'all can see, I just moved, along with my friend Chrissy, this big behind tank. I'm not strong. It was painful. But it's there. I'm about to take a three hour nap, and then I will start setting it up with sand and stuff. So I will see y'all in three hours. Okay, what is going on? So we're about to put this aquarium substrate into the 120, so, and then the sand's gonna go in there too, and we're gonna mix it together and it should look nice. I know it might not cover it all, but it's, it'll be okay. Oh my god, that was heavy. Ugh. Yes, definitely with the sand inside that tank, it's gonna it's gonna fill the bottom up. Oh, that's a good bang for your buck. So now I'm just gonna smooth it out. I might not even put that aquarium sand in here if it I might put a little bit. It depends how it looks and how it mix mixes. I think I need a little bit. You think I need a little bit? Just a little bit. Just a little bit of sand, maybe not more. Okay. We're gonna get some sand. I'm not gonna record all that jazz because who wants to watch me put sand? 
So we're putting water in and it kind of looks like a opening to a volcano. I don't know. I'm going to put it in the video. It just kind of looks cool. But we are making major progress. We're about halfway there almost. Does my camera look better? I know it does because we just cleaned the lens, but it's making progress. Guys, this is a lot of work, but it's going to be worth it. So our substrate and sand looks okay. It's going to look better once it settles. Gretchen is in a bag because she is acclimating to the new temperature. It's not cruel to put her in here. It's okay that we're putting her in here with all this new water because we put the dechlorinator in it and 30... Not 90 gallons is new water. The rest of the water is water she's done been in, so it has a little bit of culture. She has the same bio wheels as before, so everything's okay. The chlor you just had to make sure it was clean water, which it is. So she's going to chill in this bag for about 20 minutes in the dark. We're about to put the lid on this thing, put the lights on this thing, and then get that clean, and then i got to go to work. So let's go. Okay, guys, it is time to release my alligator gar into a 120-gallon tank. So she was current, she, before she was in a 29 gallon long tank, which was nowhere near big enough for her. This tank will be big enough for her for about a year or so, and then I'll be able to put her in a pond that I will eventually get. So since this water was legit this water, I'm not even going to get her out of the bag like that. I'm going to take this rubber band off, and then I'm going to allow her to turn her smart self around and Get out of the bag. Come on, Gretchen. Gretchen, get out of the bag. Whoa, a little feisty. There you go. Look how small she is. Not good line. Look at how happy she is. She has so much more room. Thank you all for watching today's video of me getting my 120 gallon aquarium, which is pretty awesome. Currently, Gretchen, my alligator gar is chilling in there. This channel is getting good. We got 27 subscribers now. I really need to get to like 1,100 and one. I don't know. I need some support. So y'all go ahead, hit the subscribe button, just smack it, and then, yeah. New videos are coming out, like three videos a week, but I have a job. I'm in school, it's a struggle. But I'm gonna make it happen. So thank y'all for watching, like, comment, and subscribe, and see you my people, but bam. Ooh. Oh, I missed.